We're live in Milwaukee. Chill on the Hill happening tonight, the first one of the season. That will continue to happen every Tuesday night through the summer. The weather out here is beautiful. Plenty of sunshine. We've got a couple of people already out here. Uh, the main show doesn't get started until 630, though. So if you want to come out tonight, you've still got a little bit of time. And the Chill on the Hill forecast, it looks pretty good. You might want a sweater, a jacket. It'll start to feel a little cooler as we head into this evening. And if you're in the shade, it'll feel a little cooler as well. So you can see we'll go from the low 60s into the 50s as we head into this evening. Uh, not much in the way of cloud cover out here. If you go close to Lake Michigan, though, we've got that lake fog. That'll continue for a few more hours, so be careful. Watch out for some reduced visibility near the lake. Now let's look at future forecasts. No rain tonight, but uh, overnight we'll see some rain moving in early Wednesday morning, a couple of showers. By the time we hit the morning commute, there will be more widespread rain, so you might need a little extra time out the door in the morning. Midday, yeah, still raining. Then late in the afternoon, uh, those showers will start to break up and become much more isolated. So the second half of Wednesday, uh, not looking too bad. It will be cool because of the rain, though. Rainfall totals. I think most of us pick up at least a half inch of rain. A couple of places could get closer to an inch. Overnight lows will drop into the 50s. Those increasing clouds late tonight and a couple of showers by early tomorrow morning. Then tomorrow rainy. I could get a couple of isolated thunder showers. Highs held back because of the clouds and the rain. 60s on Wednesday and then a chilly night Wednesday night into early Thursday. Uh, Thursday afternoon. Really nice mid 70s with some sunshine, a couple of isolated showers, not a washout for Friday. Uh, and then over the weekend, the models kind of flip flopping on whether we see some showers or not. So we'll put a low chance for showers over the weekend. We've got more news coming up after this.